I wasn't seeing an improvement by morning, to swing by and call the receptionist, my doctor only works until 11.30. She'll fit me in so she can do a proper lung assessment. Uh, apparently we have a thunderstorm. Asthma warnings too, so yay for me. Oh, you have asthma? Meds? Wait, why am I hypocrite for meds? I take medication for my issues. <laughs> what? Why am I a hypocrite? We should all watch Shawshank together from our own homes. <laughs> God damn it, Munchlax! You're in my way, buddy. Oh, I need to get my uh, my Kitakami Pokemon back. If I press the right button. Because you didn't take them at the beginning. Well, I mean, that's different. That's... I think. Maybe. It's different, right? Where did... I swear Braylon went in this box. Did... Okay, Braylon goes here now. Alright, there's our Kitakami Pokemon. But I don't usually need my puffers. Gotcha. Yeah, I didn't know you had asthma. And that's one of those weird things that you just don't expect people to know about you. <laughs> you, you don't go around saying, Hi, my name's Tish and I have asthma. Also, asthma is just such a such an awkward word to pronounce. Why are there so many consonants together like that? S-T-H-M? Sthm. Yeah, yeet. So we are working on evolving uh, a lot of Pokemon. I did get a third Jangmo, didn't I? Yes. So let's get rid of Whiskers for now, because Whiskers OP. Let's level up Druk, Flora, Harvey, Craig, and Chimkin. Get those Pokemans evolved. Pick up all the sparklies. Did we not? Oh! Gliger's a butt to evolve, isn't it? I won't be able to do that at the moment, because we're locked into daytime. But yeah, you have to uh, you have to give it a held item, the Razor Claw? And then it uh, level up at night time. Can you say Azthm again? There you go. Still going through a growth spurt, which means I'm super duper strong right now. Okay. Satoru? Satoru? Asthmatic child. Could not tell you what the breathing is, though. Oh. In and out? In and out? Is that not... Is that not how everyone breathes? Shiny Hunt Gligar? I forget what Shiny, uh, Shiny Gligar and Gliscor looks like. Isn't Shiny Gligar like a baby blue, sky blue? So I thought you were supposed to do. Yeah, I would say I'd say you've got it nailed. I think you're you're doing pretty good. If you're doing in and out, in and out, I think you're you're breathing correctly. Aren't you like quad weak to gr uh, bug? Schmack. Cool. Okay, Craig should evolve here. Gotta help my Pokemon grow too, huh? Yeah. It dum dum. <gasps> Good job, Craig! So if you guys haven't been around while we've been doing the DLC Pokedex, uh, every time we catch new Pokemon, I'm just calling someone out in chat and be like, Yo, you, give me a nickname for this Pokemon. It's kind of fun and interesting. This gluttonous Pokemon eats con uh, constantly, same. Apart from when it's asleep, same. Devours nearly 900 pounds of food per day. Same. <laughs> That's a lot of food, actually. I wouldn't say I'd devour 900 pounds. I could. I could, if I wanted to. Yeah, I need another Nuzleaf. Uh, any Pokemon here that we need to evolve? What we could do is we can get... Sigligore, <laughs> close to evolving. 
Because I'm not using uh, candies either. Don't hate me for murdering you so much. Why have you been murdering Snorlax? What does Snorlax do to you? I like this area. This area is cool. A little bit barren, but I think that's by design. Looks like a rough place to maybe shiny hunt for uh, Nose Pass, but maybe a good spot for uh, Timber. Uh, Jangmoo as well is the only dragon around here, which is good. Uh, Gligar is the only flying type, it seems. So this area seems pretty good for shiny hunting some new DLC mons. If you love me... Uh-oh. Evolve me. Hey, Callum. I got three shiny authentic synesties. If you love me, let me go. That's what I told my parents. Now I'm here on my own journey. Oh. That wasn't what I was expecting it to be. Nanami, the festival girl. Well, oh, damn. That's mad. Yeah, we got it all in one outbreak. It was pretty good. Pretty good. I'm a Pokemon legend. I guess we can only really act scissor here. This could be... Oh, this was a bad idea. We are quad weak to... Flying, and it chose to use... Interesting. It chose to use a Dark-type move. Where's my generous baby? Oh, the Snorlax! You did a Snorlax outbreak that gave five herb Mystica. See? It's going to be a while until Sigligor evolves. Every journey has its ups and downs. True, true. Hi, Gligar. There's a lot of really cool Pokemon around here. And Orthworm. Oh, Spoink. I didn't even see Spoink down there. Mousehold. Ew. Ew. We. I made it. Where's Kieran? You've unlocked a new area for the Ogre Ousting game. Oh, okay. Is this it? Where's Kieran? These are the Paradise Barrens. Pretty lonely place, huh? According to the old legends, the Ogre used to be seen around here lots. Hey, before we check out the sign, could you battle me? Uh-oh. Let's do it. I'm not ready for this. Okay, let me heal up our Pokemon. I'm not ready for this. Cool Pokemon and Orthworm. Well, yeah, but I'd like... I'd, you know? We've already seen Orthworm. This time I'll win. He needs to fix his hair. This is a problem. Restricting my Paleo playtime, it's gone out of hand. I actually haven't played it for a, for a minute. Go on, hit this blizzard. You got this. Ah! Yes, let's go! That was terrible. His nose must be itchy with that hairstyle, right? His sister's got the same one. It's weird. Uh, it's probably going to use Giga Drain again. Let's try Chimkin. I'm having chicken for the dinner this evening. We got a big old chicken. I'm gonna roast it. I'm gonna have chicken for like the next three days to eat. Dog buzz. Okay, that's rude. Nice. Good job, Wallaby. Oh my god, that is a lot, Tish. But it's good that you've been enjoying it. I've been kind of on a. 
Hmm. I don't know how to say. I've been enjoying when I do play, but I haven't really had the motivation to play a lot. Um, when the new update came out, and it was really, really buggy, I was kind of, kind of put me off it. And when they released the hotfix, I had Pokemon to play. <laughs> Let's see if we can get a Fell Stinger in here. Hey, Tiz! I'm good, thanks. How are you? Tidy up. What's the point of that? Attack Rose. Oh, I didn't know it did that. Attack and speed goes up? Yeah, like... I think people are getting a little bit bored of it. Um... There's no way we can get a Fell Stinger in here and win. Double edge, we're dead. Before the update, I can play for long because I get motion sick. Oh, okay. Um, okay, let's use a... Uh, let's use Sigligore. Back from vacation! Take me back, but otherwise I'm fine. How was your vacation? I'm assuming your vacation was good. <laughs> let's go! Honestly, you're just heal bait, Sigligore. Polyrath, you see what I mean? Make more progress. Yeah, I think for me, it's not that I've... Hmm. It's not that I've, like... There's less and less for me to do now. Because I haven't been into it before. Swords dance to see what happens. We're faster than Polyrath. Okay. Yeah, knew that was coming. The sea was wonderful. Whereabouts did you go? Did you just go somewhere else in Italy, Tiz, or did you go? Uh, did you go abroad? I'm not jealous at all. By the way, I'm not jealous at all. And the bundles. Totally forgot about those. Yeah, you see- Oh, dear. That's fine. See, um... Oh, wow. I- I haven't played since they fixed the, uh, the flowstone bug. Exactly, Teach. That's the thing. I think I'm completing the content that's in the game quicker than they're adding more. You can holiday in your kitchen. <laughs> I'm going for a terror here just so I can guarantee the knockout. Alright, how does this thing keep hitting hydro pumps? Yeah! No, oh no, I can't keep up! Sardinia! It was my first time there. It's the best Italian sea, in my opinion. Ooh wee! <gasps> Diplin. Is quad weak to ice? <sighs> let's use. Yep, yeah, let's use one of our Jangmo. Honestly, like. I feel like there are loads of countries where you can go on vacation in the same country. I think you can do that in the UK, but it's not fantastic. <laughs> like, if you live in Spain, you can go on holiday in Spain and still have, like, a, a chill, great time. Like, America is so big that you've got, like, different climates for everybody, so I feel like that's fine as well. But, like, UK is just always so... yeah. Rip. I'll probably drop Paleo for a bit when that comes out. Ah, right. Makes sense. Makes sense. 
Um, I don't want to use Harvey because Harvey's going to evolve. I don't think I have any. Oh, I've got bug moves. Yeah, CK just got your DM. Uh huh. I'm just like, oh. All right, one more should be good. You got this, Diblin. Get them all covered in syrup. When I was resetting for uh, for the Sinister Outbreak, I did get an Outbreak for Applin, and I was very tempted to go and get one for Shiny Diplin. Impala, thank you very much for the 37-month resub. Streaking for nearly three years. That is crazy. Thank you, Impala. Much appreciated. We're getting some, like, super high up monthly sub counts now, which is absolutely mad. Thank you all. It's all because I'm too weak. Harvey's evolving to one of my favorite Pokemons ever. Oh! Mama Swine! I love this little fuzzball. A frozen Mama Swine was dug from ice dating back to 10,000 years. Uh, this Pokemon has been around a long, long, long time. Wants to learn double hit? Nah, you don't need to learn double hit, buddy. You're fine. Is that it? The only evolution? Okay. I lost. <laughs> the floor just wiggling. It's because I'm weak. That's why I... We should go check out the sign. Come on, let's get this over with. Pile of swine's eyes. Yeah, he's got little eyes underneath his uh, eyebrow flaps. <laughs> What's the shiny of that look like? Which one? Uh, Mama swine? I think Mama swine shiny is like green. Uh, if you see a shadowy figure approaching you outside the villager at twilight, be wary. Don a mask at once and hide your face. Do so, and whether the shadow is a man or monster, you will pass each other by as fellow mask wearers. Green meeple. If you should meet the shadow when you have no mask in hand, then pray it is only a man. If it is, you will live to see another day, and you will remember to never forget your mask again. But if it is the ogre, you will meet your end, as do all humans who f whose faces are seen by it. Once it sees your face, your soul will be forfeit, and you shall never return to the village. Oh my god. Hey, sub. Ah, yes, it arrived! That's good, because I only sent it on Saturday. In the old days, everyone carried masks wherever they went, and the one who made those masks was actually my great 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 grandpa's great 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 grandpa or something. It's amazing. I mean, I don't think any of that stuff about the ogre stealing souls is true or anything, but it is true that our family used to make masks. Our family has a long line of mask makers. Even my gramps can make them. I even heard that the reason they we hold the festival of masks is because our ancestors came up with the idea. I don't really like what they wrote on this sign here. Just because the ogre seems sort of scary, everyone got afraid of it and drove it away from the village. I'm pretty sure the ogre must have been lonely on its own. Ah, oh, it's true. Left all alone like that? Treated like some kind of outcast? You're right. We know the truth. You think so too, huh, Dazzle? What is that face? I don't know. Stickers! Indeed. We are 12 away from the next sticker giveaway, by the way. And I have five <laughs> international stamps that I pre-bought. Yeah, when I went to the post office, <laughs> I... Because I, I had two international stamps to send the ones for Chasm and CC. Um, so I went to the post office in the town that I went to on Friday uh, to do my, my pickups for work. I was like, look, I've got one to send to the UK, one to send international. Can I send those, please? And can I please have five international stamps? Just because I don't know when the one in town is going to open up again. No, I'm nowhere near done, I don't think, CC. Once I had that last photo, is he going to be miserable again? Oh, look at him. 
They're so cute. <laughs> well, we're all done with our assignment now, but I gotta get stronger with my Pokemon. I'm gonna head home. Edgelord. Yeah, he's 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 upsetty spaghetti. Because we know the truth and we're keeping it from him. Oh wait, what does the game want me to do now? Oh. Is it head back to the village? Yeah. Looks a bit like CK's hair. It does! What an edgelord. <laughs> Alright chat, we have two options available to us. We can carry on with the story, or we can go explore the north of Kitakami. I might explore for a little bit first. But I am also very much aware that I want to wrap up this Pokedex as quick as I can. I don't want to rush myself, but like, I want to, I want to get my uh, Pokedex tracker updated. I just want to see what new Pokemon I can find. Oh, Callum! Um, someone was saying earlier, I think it was Bactrian, that somewhere... In Kitakami, uh, the Timeless Woods, Electros will spawn in the grass and not in the water. So, you know, that shiny living dex. Definitely explore. Oh, okay. I thought I would be, like, um, reliant on the story. The grass eel, that guy. I should probably go around. I don't think there's any more Pokemon in this area that are new to me. So I should probably go around on Coridon. At me when there's two quacks running around. Are you actually gonna do some uh, some more more eggs? A birdie told me that it's safe to come back to your Pokemon streams. <laughs> Skippity doo. Alright, chat, you ready for a spoiler of what Pokemon's in the DLC? Ready for this? You can't handle this. It's. Ariados. <laughs> At least not for a while. Oh, you're. Oh, I think I know what you're doing. I think I know what you're doing. I don't know what Jang Moo Shiny is, and I don't think I want to know. I think I want to keep it a secret. For when we go and Shiny hunt it, I want to I want to be surprised. An egg hatch. What? So you're saying you'd rather do anything else but hatch eggs, but also you don't want to shiny hunt other Pokemon. <laughs> Got Graveler here. Nuzleaf! I need Nuzleaf. I need to heal. He ya! Curveball! Buzzleaf, get back! Buzzleaf, don't you dare! Oh, so you, if you're gonna shiny hunt, you're gonna do some Kitakami shiny hunting. I see. Okay. That's fair. I understand that. He's out of here. Oh, that was, that, that was a rip. Sunny day? Uh, let's just go for a Dusk Ball. It is Dusk right now. Uh, no catch. Uh, okay. 
See, I, I think X Scissor will kill him. Leaf Blade won't do much. Let's, let's slap him with a Leaf Blade. There we go. Alright, he's gonna use Sunny Day for a third time. Oh, it failed! There's a surprise. Shoot. Alright, let's hit it with uh, one more Leaf Blade. If we get a crit, it's dead. Okay. Yo, what's up, Ollie? Can I ask a question unrelated to the current game you're playing? Absolutely, sure. Yeah, yeah, we don't just have to talk about the game we're playing and what we're doing. But thank you for asking. Can very considerate of you. CC, what are we going to call Nuzleaf? We're going to evolve this guy into a Shiftery. Pop -a -da -pop. Oh, I need to get my uh, my keyboard while CC has a think. Oh. Rider of Wind. I've heard about that. That's a pretty pretty big update. I wonder if we're going to see a lot of shiftery in competitive. How are you feeling about Paleo? Has it turned out you're hoping, or does it feel differently? Uh, it's turned out how I was hoping. It's just um, I'm finding myself less and less motivated to play these days. But it's still a very fun, very chill game, and I've still got to remember that it's in beta, you know, early access. Every two weeks, they're, they're adding so much more to it. Um, and it's enough to bring me back and be like, ooh, what's this? Ooh, what's that? And I like, get a bunch of quests. So it's, it's good. It's good. But I'm still like, I feel like I'm completing more of the game than they're adding more of too. So I feel like eventually I'm going to reach a point where... I'm not going to want to play for a bit. But we shall see. Alright chat, CC's taking forever. I'm going to need other nickname suggestions from chat. What are we going to call this guy? We're not going to call it CK. Less motivation. Yeah, yeah, so it's like... Mr. Leaf. Ernie? <laughs> That's too good. <laughs> Thank you, Cozy. I'm not calling it CK, Tish. Mandibuzz! I'm very uncreative. I liked it, though. It was funny. <laughs> it's always searching for food for Vullaby. It finds a weak Pokemon, Mandibuzz swoops it right off to its nest. Very good. Bone rush? No thanks. You should never rush the bone. Probably a bad idea. Recipe for disaster. Oh, why am I doing it that way? We should be doing it this way. One of my only two Pokemons I need to finish my new decks. That reminds me. Nice. Very nice. I need to get a Chime Echo. And I only seem to have one... Did I not catch a second Timber that I evolved into... I know I've got a Gerda down here waiting to evolve. Did I not catch a second one that I evolved? Found it. Oh god, I've got another... Okay. Okay, we're, we're getting close to finishing all the decks stuff, I think. I say that, I don't think I am, really. Hey, Stella! Hey, likely to see you so far. I'm honestly not sure if I want to spend the money for it. I've been having a lot more fun on this DLC than I thought I would, honestly. One of the six wonders of Kitakami, the Gracious Stones. Only a select few know the, of this power spot, the Gracious Stones. Curiously, no grass grows within their ring. Curiouser yet, gazing upon them lifts the spirits. Wow, I feel so much happier. That's just a straight up Lorantis spawn. Okay. Yeah, I've um I've been enjoying the DLC. Um You know, there's a hundred new Pokemon for me to discover here. I say new, but you know what I mean. Hundred Pokemon that won in the game, but That's just straight up a wild Annihilate. ape. Okay. Hundred Pokemon that won in the game before that are now added. 
um, a new bit of story to, to complete, a new area to look at, new shinies to go and get. I'm uh, I'm in my element. I like it. Oh, hi, Nug. How we doing, Nug? But if you don't feel like spending the money yet, I completely understand that. Um, at some point later this year, we should be getting... Oh! Quack! He's back! Cramorant! Let's go! I don't think there was a shiny in our life, no. It's a boy! This could be bad. Yeah, he confused himself. Um, but I don't have anything to play. Yeah, that's fair. That's that's totally fair. Let's use a nest ball here. Or net ball, sorry. Oh, Cramoran! We're, we're just gonna call him Quack. I'm gonna call him Quack Attack. But we, 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 we gotta call him after the boy. Cramran instinctively swallow everything whole. Same. Oh, this is a Viva Pinata fun. <laughs> they're at their most formidable when they're struggling to swallow overly large prey. Oh my god. Quack. The second. He's back. He's... Oh, I can't put him on my team. I want to put him on my team because it's Cramorant, and Cramorant's just fun. But... I, I can't do it because we just had a playthrough when we used Cramorant. Exactly cozy. <laughs> Hakamoo? Sounds like Dad's dog. I want to name it Bandit now. <laughs> Gets into fistfights so intense that the scales of its arms peel off. Ew. Bare arms are a sign of valiance. I've never really played with the uh, Jang Moo line too much. Uh, right, where are we? I guess there. Oh, I really want to. I really. Ah, oh, do I use Quack the second? Let's get Gala in because I was using Gala as well. See, I was thinking about this, right? And I was like, what Pokemon do I want to use for my team? I was like, I kind of want to use Mamoswine. But we literally just use Mama Swine in uh, like a Gold Soul Silver playthrough. Like Mian Shao, I haven't used since Gen Five. I've never used the Livani. Obviously, I've never used a Diplin before. Um, so I, I'm kind of trying to stay away from Pokemon I've used quite recently. Even Quagsire. I haven't even been using Wendy. I'm kind of tempted to use Poliwrath. I think I'm going to use Poliwrath on my on my team. Do you transfer Snorlax in? No, I evolve my Munchlax. Found a Munchlax, I evolved it. He's called Craig. Oh wait, Flora was meant to be the evolved. Yeah, Flora was meant to be Hakamoo. Let's get rid of Whiskers for now. Druk is meant to be... Um, the final form that I can't remember the name of. I heard you say, I've never used a shower before and became a little concerned. Oh, I've used a shower, don't worry. I didn't for about 14 months while we were waiting for the, the bathroom to be finished. I say finished, it's not finished at the moment. But I didn't have a functioning shower for like 14 months. I Don't worry, I had a, a working bath. I, I took baths. <laughs> but now, I live in the shower. Right, we must be too close to the water because the game's struggling to do things. Are you sure? Absolutely. I don't smell that bad. Jeez. Should I have a better bathtub? I like baths. In, in my last house, the bathtub was tiny. I could not fit in it. Now I'm a big fella. I'm not very tall, but I'm quite wide. I'm horizontally tall. Uh,
But yeah, it was, um, I could, like, lay down it properly. Anonymous, thank you very much for that gifted sub over to Stella. Thank you, Anonymous, whoever you may be. You sneaky sneakster. Stella, hope you enjoy your gifted sub. Skip it boo What? What's what, Nug? Back to room with the eyes emoji. Absolutely not sus at all whatsoever. Not not at all. Not one one way. The OSOS or challenge. Challenge Annika? Bathtub when we were house shopping at the beginning of the year was a deal maker or breaker. I said no to a few houses because they had horrible tubs. I completely understand that. My mum is the same when going on vacation now. Or when, when she likes needs to stop at a Premier Inn. She she can't stand having showers. It's a bathtub like or, or deal breaker. Whereas I'm the opposite. I don't want to fill up a tub of water and then try and clean myself in it. No. Nah. Five minutes in the shower. Scrub myself down. Get out. Done. Bish bash bosh. Bactrian is never sus. Bactrian is one of the most sus. Okay, are we going to cross over the river here? I think we should cross over the river. That's a terrestrial swanner. Have we evolved our Duckler into Swanner yet? We must have done. Yeah. Currently Bactrian banned from spending as much dollar as I can on anything fun. <laughs> what a mood. Freestanding bathtub would be amazing. Yeah. I mean, that would just look epic. I'm lucky because I've got like a massive bathroom. I could I could quite happily like if if I stripped the bathroom back to bare bones, I could quite easily fit in a freestanding bathtub and have it look good. If it weren't for like the 15 degree floor angle that the floor slopes at. Can't remember the last time I took a bath. Ew. Alp, that's gross. Like at least once a year. You just happen to know whom's this particular anonymous is. Oh! That's very sus. <laughs> Alright, doesn't look like there's any new Pokemans over here. <gasps> Shiny Dot? No. But good to know that C-Dot spawned in packs over here. Look at them little hopping away in line. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Tish. The C-Dot's hopping? Yeah, that was adorable. <laughs> I want that. Hey, Dazza. How far are you into the DLC? We just... Um, we just found the third signpost, and we have a mission now to go back home. Um, or back to home base. But I'm exploring. Anonymous! Thank you very much for the gifted over to Dragon Pockets. Thank you, Animus. Whoever you may have been. Thank you all for the gifted subs. We are, we are ten away from a sticker giveaway. Just saying. Ten away from a sticker giveaway. I have international stamps available. <laughs> if you live in the UK, good luck. I don't have any UK stamps. Doodly do, doodly do. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> Although I can get UK stamps quite easily. I just have to go to the news agents. UK gets hand delivered. That would be quite funny, wouldn't it? You win a sticker giveaway, and I'm like, well, I don't have any stamps, but I know your address, so I'm just gonna just gonna bring it to your house. <laughs> Building a new team for the DLC, so you can be on the same power levels as the NPCs. Yeah, I have been. Um, I'm struggling with what Pokemon to use, though. At the minute, I've got Diplin, because it's new, 
and I love at the Aplin line. Uh, I've got Levani, and I have Mian Xiao. Those are the three that I'm using, but I'm also trying to compile a living decks as I go, so I don't have, like, all of my Pokemon available at the same time. Hey, what's up? Here's your stickers. Peace. No, I wouldn't even do that. I'd just post it through Letterbox. <laughs> you get you get an envelope. <gasps> hey, buddy! Hey, what's up? How's it going, Quagsire? You doing good? Yeah? Just chilling, me too. Hey, did you catch the game the other night? Hey, what? what's your- oh. Yeah, what's your thought on that new restaurant that opened down the road? Okay, I'm just gonna- I, I, I'm sorry to interrupt. I'll see you again soon. The immediate mood change. <laughs> it's Quagsire! How could I not? Football, chess, MMA, esports. Uh, rock, paper, scissors. I think Quagsire only has, like, the capacity to understand rock, paper, scissors. Even then, take out scissors. You know, that that's too complicated for him. He's, he's a rock, paper kind of guy. Although he always chooses rock. Oh, TM over here. Misty Explosion. I couldn't read it in time. Tic-tac-toe seems more his speed. Group of Lotad? Yeah, I can't wait to get Shiny Lotad as well. The Lotad line's awesome, and we're going to see a lot of shiny Lotads, I think, or Ludicolo in uh, VGC. Rain teams are really going to, like, be predominant, uh, pro prominent. Kind of don't want to go into the woods over there yet. Kind of want to wait until I get round to... Oh, that outbreak! Yeah, I think I'm going to go through Fellhorn Gorge and go up to here. Well, we're right here. We might as well just do a lap. British Bake Off. <laughs> well, this is weird. There's... Oh, no, it's not weird at all. Never mind. I'm being dumb dumb. Yeah, let's just go into the Timeless Woods. Yeah, yeah. Pikachu! Hi. So we got Impy Dump. That's a terrestrial Quagsire. Um, hello? Hi, I just want to talk. What's up, buddy? Ground type? Poison type. Okay. Look at him with his arms out. Because he's swimming. One adorable little Quagsire. I just wanted to say hi. I'm just going to leave. Oh, you're level 71. Oh, okay. Hey, have a good night, Tish. Thank you very much for popping in. I appreciate you. And uh, we shall see you when we see you. I hope you feel better. That's a Litwick. That's a Litwick. That's a Litwick. Bye, Tish. <laughs> Sorry, got distracted. Oh. Oh. It's level 73. Valid distraction. <laughs> you love him so much, Nog? Me too. He's the best.
He's my best. He is the best friend, and I accidentally broke one of my Litwick candle holders, so I gotta order a new one. Oh no! Back to him. What do we call Litwick? What are we calling him? I did name it Gel, because he's a, he's a tailor. <laughs> its flame is usually out, but it starts shining when Litwick absorbs life force from people or Pokemon. Oh, rude. What are we going to call her, Bactrian? I'm so happy. Pokemon here are really high level and it's kind of scary. Bactrian? Bactrian's thinking. I'm here. Hello, Bactrian. Sorry, I'm putting you on the spot. I was chewing what happened. Oh. Well, if you like an update, I need a nickname for Litwick. You didn't hear. Oh! Oh, Bactrian, would you please nickname my, my Litwick? What did I do? Yeah, no, no, I'm, I'm asking you for a nickname because... Because Litwick and you broke the candle or something. God, I expect you all to pay full attention to what's going on. No, I will zone out if I want to zone out. Hey there, sorry to interrupt, but I totally get where you're coming from. Sometimes we all need a little zoning out time, right? Uh, it can be nice to just disconnect from the world and have some some alone time. So go ahead and enjoy your zone out session. What's your favorite way to relax and unwind? Paraffin. Thank you. Now we need two more. Lampen evolves with a dusk stone, doesn't it? Oh, trees. So the game's got. That is a Trevenant. Hiya! Trevenant's got a cool shiny, man. Forest's Curse? But it failed. I don't even know what that means. Alright, chat, start thinking of a nickname for Trevenant. I might call upon any of you. Destiny Bond? Uh oh. Trevenant's a... It's a cool Pokemon. I wouldn't call it dope. I think it's okay. Oh, hey, Tudor. Groot. Oh, it kind of has to be Groot, doesn't it? <laughs> Trivenant. <laughs> okay. All right. It's going to be Trivenant. And then, and then we have to call Phantom Groot. Using its roots, Trevenant connects itself to trees and monitors every corner of its forests. It uses curses to drive intruders away. Trivenant. I am Groot. Hi, Triven. We just caught Trevenant, and it's called Trivenant. Oh wait, did I already catch a Phantom? Oh. I think I did, actually. <laughs> My favorite Pokemon of the DLC so far, too. Nice. Uh, right. Flora is evolved. Fantastic. Uh, do we already have Phantom? We do, and we called it Phantom. So we're not going to call it Groot, sadly. Uh, right, let's get... Down to business. Oh, Jan Mega. I was using Jan Mega on my team as well, wasn't I? He's only level 58. He needs some levels. Jojo's Bizarre Adventure character with its hard scale. Uh, I, I don't know what that is. Wait, I have a... Why do I have an exclamation mark on? Oh, is it because I caught a new form of Sinistee? 
We'll never know. Uh, what was I doing? I was trying to claim my, my reward. So, yes or no's only, no spoilers. Is this the only way to get a dusk, uh, a Reaper Cloth for Evolving Dust Noir into, oh sorry, Evolving Dust Clops into Dust Noir? Is this the only way? Is this the way? This is the way? We got Stantler? More Litwicks, I, did, I do need more Litwicks. Dragon Pockets, that's not very helpful. No. Thank you, Factrian. I don't know. Thank you, Tiz. <laughs> I think. Very nice. Second Litwick acquired. Chat, what are we going to call this? It will be a Lampent. Soot. Thomas Edison. I don't like the name Thomas. For reasons. Nope. Sir. Please. Because of the train? No, not because of the train. The train's cool. I used to want to be the train when I grew up, when I was like three. I used to know a Thomas. He ended up being a massive insert choice of curse word here. Still waiting for my first random shiny. Yes, he ended up being a massive silly billy. Poopy head, exactly. He was a massive butt, you're right, yeah. He was a massive butt poopy head silly billy. Oh, that's just a straight up Grim Snarl? Hey yo! I don't even know whereabouts I am in the woods at the moment. It's another Litwick. I'm gonna hold off on catching a second Litwick because we might come across a Lampent. We got Charger Bug in here. Just a fully evolved Hatterene. Oh, there's a Lampent. Perfect. He ya. Strong words. I'm sorry, Al. I'm sorry you had to see that. The original Red Ranger was always superior to the Green Ranger. I see you. That's a that's taste right there. So would you say you're lost in the woods? Maybe. Memento. What a bummel. Oh well, it's okay. Just remember that shiny lampants might use Memento. <laughs> Save in front of lampants. Could be your demise. This woodsy area is kind of cool, though. It's not lagging as much as, um... Oh, I made it to the exit. Uh, Lombre, no! It's not lagging as much as Lag Tree Thicket. I'm gonna carry on exploring, though. We should look up in trees, too. There might be stuff in trees. What a complete lamp stand. I love the creative use of, um, no cursing. <laughs> oh, you lamp stand. Misty's rain. You'll knock the memory, but I agree with you. I was never a Power Rangers kid, I never watched it. I'm trying to remember what shows I did watch as a kid, but it wasn't Power Rangers. 
There doesn't seem to be any other Pokemon around here, really, unless it's a rare spawn. Oh, Electric is around here. That's so bizarre to me. The stupid Electric Eel pops up around here. Hey, Toad's Crew, what up? I was hoping we'd see a new Convergent form in the DLC. That would have been cool. Yeah, look at it. It's just chilling here. Yeah, I've seen Grass Eel. The Italian theme was a bop. I shall leave me alone. Just picking up stuff that people have dropped on the floor. Did that Toad's Crawl just peek out from behind a tree? <laughs> Born at the right time when the OG Power Rangers in the States were still popular. Yeah, see, I was I was born in '92, and I just I just don't think I got into Power Rangers. I think the OG Power Rangers were still like popular. You know, there were lunch boxes and whatnot at school. It just wasn't something that I was personally into. Can't find another Lampen, but I might just get a Litwick. The Lampen's just going to use Memento. Oh, there's a Lampen. Let's give it a go. Lots of Hatterenes around as well. Hey, Lampshade. Well, oh, that worked. Same year as your big brother was born? Yeah, yeah, yeah. October 92. I'm going to be 31. Hey, we got it. Right, chat, what are we going to call our chandelier? Lampent appears right at the moment of death and promptly absorbs the spirit as it leaves the body. Wow, that's rude. Yeah, the shiny Litwick line is good. It's very good. Um, I'm going to call it Larry. Not gonna lie, he kind of seems like he sucked the life out of, well, self, to be honest, but. Soul lamp from Minecraft. When did Minecraft add soul lamps? That's, uh, that's news to me. Uh, where is my other... Not paraffin. But Larry, we should have another... Did I not catch two Litwicks? I swear I caught two Litwicks. Yeah, we got Soot. Okay. Think Sigligore is close to evolving? Yeah, 2,100 experience. We just need to get the item and wait until night time. Skibbity-boo. Update 1.15? That means nothing to me. <laughs> You're April 1992. There you go, Kami. How you doing? Welcome. How are the 30s treating you? <laughs> I think that's all for this time that's in these woods. It's too warm again? Nah, it's alright. We've had a nice rainstorm over here, Tudor. Oh. Just absolutely wicked all the heat away. It's been lovely. So that's my sweat. Um, no, I don't particularly want to talk to your sweat. Thank you. Come again. Kind of cold. It's getting there. I feel like we, we are all definitely seeing the back end of summer now. Which I think some people enjoy, some people don't. Me, as a, as a big bloke, I like the sun, I like the summer, but I like being able to cool down when I need to. Alright, let's, let's head over here. I want to see what this outbreak is. I'm intrigued. 
I'm wondering if it might be a particular teapot. Hey, Clover Ann. Summer. Bye. <laughs> then again, it is Florida. Ah, Florida's just like permanently hot, though. Lots of Illumise. Roll beats as well. I'm wearing a hoodie out right now. It feels like summer's ending. Yeah, I think it is. Summer's on its way out. Which is weird, because like a week ago we had like low 30s over here, which for this time of year isn't common at all. Oh god, that sounds awful, Stella. Hope we get more than two days of fall this year. <laughs> oh, I want to get the camera out, I think, again in, in fall. Autumn, sorry, autumn. I don't want to be here. I want to be up here. <laughs> have a good nap, no. Have a good nap. Heat crash? Oh god, okay. There's a TM? Ooh. Make sure you get absolutely nothing done. <laughs> we got a Terrastal Vika Vault up here. Oh wait, why have I got... Why have I got Larry in my party as a level up? He he needs a Dusk Stone. No, it's not Razor Fang, is it? That evolves, um... Isn't it Razor Claw? That you need for, uh, Gliscor? You said no backseat gaming. Fang? Oh, it is the Fang. Okay, thank you. Nice speedy Pokemon for water hunts. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. The spirits burned up in this ominous flame lose their way and wander the world forever. Yikes. Chandelure is a cool Pokemon. You know what? I don't have a fire or a ghost type on my team yet. Maybe I'll use Larry. Maybe I will actually just use Larry on my team. And you know what? I kind of ah uh, no, I do want to use um, Hakumoo or whatever its final evolution is. Jangmo Hakumoo. Can't remember what the last one is. Larry Moo. But 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 I've already got Diplin as a dragon type. He's Larry and Sword and Shield, and I like him. He's a really good special attacker. Alright, chat. What do you think we're going to see in this out? Actually, no, don't answer that because it's a Pokemon I haven't seen yet. I'm going to head to it now. I'm just going to go, I'm just going to beeline for it. It's over that way. I think it might be the antique form of Sinistee, which would be really cool. Um, it's a non-working outbreak. Yeah, Duskstone for Chandelure. Yeah, yeah. Cave, maybe? Yeah, it could be underneath. Or, like, uh, the, the level down below. Outbreaks that won't work? I know, right? Madness! Wee. Hey, Francois, what's up? Guess who got three shiny authentic Sinisties earlier today? This guy! 
Okay, well, I've got a non-working outbreak, and I don't know what the Pokemon is either. That's kind of upsetting. It's a new Pokemon right there. That's really annoying. <laughs> That's really annoying. Oh, Game Freak, you billion dollar company. To their credit, they did fix a bunch of stuff 10 months after the game launched, so you know. Priorities, am I right? That's, 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 that's annoyed me. Mainly because I want to know what Pokemon it is. Oh, rip. It will be something that spawns in this area, but there's a question mark around it, which means I haven't seen it or registered it yet. It's none of these. How weird. Oh well. I haven't seen any new Pokemon since coming to the zone. Yeah, I've I've encountered uh, Illumise and Volbeat. I've got them both registered. Oh well. Welcome to Pokemon in the 2023. You know what I mean? I'm kind of not surprised. <laughs> Heal Ball. That'll make someone happy. Well, maybe this time it'll take six months. Oni Mountain. Chilling Waterhead. What? Why is it black and white in here? Ooh, cave, right? Sneasel? Tynamo? Oh, no. <laughs> Not Tynamo. Please leave me alone. No, Tynamo, leave me alone! Maybe the outbreak is in here? That's what I'm thinking. I just saw a cave. Because it, it looks like it could be in the cliffside, maybe. Got Goomy? Whoopy? Oh my. Look, I'm happy to see you too, pal. But if you wouldn't mind just scooching over a bit, I've got... I'll make my way through here. Got Mianfu, we got the Swine Up family, it would seem. Snow Run, Gumi again. Hey, Snow Run, what's up, buddy? This area is kind of cool, though. There's another cave over there. Exit or entrance, maybe? Quaxa, what's up, buddy? How you doing? How's it going, pal? Doing good? I'm just stopping by, you know, don't mind me. Where am I? I'm exploring. The old lake. Being blinded by the sun that's shining through the cave wall, of course. Okay. Skippity doo. Blizzard. Can I climb up here? I can. Glad to see they didn't fix the water glare. Yeah, the water glare is as ugly and intrusive as it always has been. Got another cave exit over here. This area is, um, really maze-like. Oh, hi, Magikarp. Oh, hey, man, Fu. Uh, don't mind me, I just... I know you've been... I know you've been probably saving this for a friend, but that's my dive ball. Yoink! TM at the end. Flip turn? Flip turn as a TM? 
Who can learn that? That's a Palafin signature move. That's interesting. That's really interesting. Okay. Wowzers. Oh, there's TM down there. I want that. You can learn it. That is true. You can play this game for months. Need to get on it. Thinking about uh, getting the DLC Clover in. And Vaporeon. Interesting. Oh, that's Carbink. Oh, that's a flying Swinub. Maybe the car Carbink is what I could see. Can I... I'm trying to... Carbink kind of looks a little like Baby Yoda, doesn't it? You see what I mean with like the eyes poking out the top and the ears? Just a little bit. You have lots going on. That's fair. It's not going anywhere, is it? I do have to name him Grogu, yeah. That's a thing we must have to do now. One, two, three. I don't have anything that can really damage this guy. I could... Uh, it's got a high defense. I could try a Leaf Blade. That shouldn't KO it. Cool. Power gem might hurt. Oh, wow. Are you kidding me? Top of the stone edge. Rip? Yeah. Trying to catch in a luxury ball because I think it fits it well. Yeah. Of course. It's not a nice way to make a first impression on your new sister. New sister? Let's go! Driplin leveled up. Oh, Diplin, sorry, not Driplin. It slept underground for hundreds of millions of years since its birth. It occasionally found during excavation of caves. It, uh, it's genderless. I realize that. Rogu! Has been added to my party. Okay. Now, I wonder if that's going to update the, um... No, it wasn't a Gro It wasn't a Grogu. It wasn't, um... It wasn't a carving. Hundreds of millions, yeah. I wonder how they know that. You know, who who asked it? Hey, how long have you been sleeping for? And it was like, oh, hundreds of millions of years. All right, we need Jan Mega back. Because it's low level. Up we go. Quagsire, don't... Don't mind me coming through. Thank you. Squeezing by. How does it know? Yeah. There was one time I fell asleep and I woke up at 4 a.m. And it was in the winter and I legitimately thought I woke up at 4 p.m. and missed work. Like, I thought I slept for like 16 hours when I had only slept for four. I'm glad I'm no longer in that sort of phase of my life. <laughs> Alright, we have a trainer up here. My goo! My precious little goo loves dark places. That, that, Yoshino? Yoshino? I know Yoshino. Uh, that's, uh, that's too much information.
This could be a problem. Uh oh. Never mind. No goo. Don't go into the light. Stay away from the light. I think I don't see that up there. Drill run. Okay. I just like goodies. Looks like we've actually got some light up here as well. Cave exit, maybe? Got two choices. I'm just going higher and higher. It reminds me of that ELO song. Oh! <gasps> Don't go to the light! But it's so pretty! Oh. There's not really much up here, is there? Slugma lava? Alright, where's Slugma? Oh, I just remembered what the game told- Oh, there's a whole part of the mountain that we missed. The game was like, yeah, to get to the signpost that was here, we should have gone through this place here. Like, when we when we went up to Oni Mountain, it told us to go, like, over here somewhere to the, to the den. Or we could carry on going through the moor. And there was, like, poisonous gas. So I guess we're kind of working our way there now. There's a ladder here. There's another Chingling. But Chingling's a bee to evolve. So I'm hoping I'm going to uh, find a Chimeco. How high is this ladder? And who installed it? So they did a good job. It's very straight. Nice and vertical. And there's another one. Why am I using the ladder when I can use my dragon? That's way quicker. <laughs> Slugma! Holy smokes. Okie dokie. That's a terrestrial uh, lampant over there. Friendship Evos are the worst. Yeah, they're okay with, um, like, berries. If you've got a lot of berries. Recover. couldn't pay me enough to climb that. I'm a bit of a thrill seeker, so I probably would. Don't you dare say it, Tudor. You know exactly what I'm talking about. I got you a 69 second timeout last time. This time I'll make it 420. You heard. I have no idea. No shinies yet, lady. Alright, chat, we need a nickname for this Slugma. What are we gonna call it? Its lava body can cool and chip away at times, but magma buff will heal it right up. Ah. Hatred. I'm not calling it hatred. He's cute. Nuts. Good enough. Dude, if we get a shiny Slugma here, I would be very happy. Now, is that enough to satiate you, Tudor? Are, are you satiated now? We got the TM for Scold. Oh my goodness. Quagsire, you're coming home, buddy. I should make a competitive team that uses both Quagsire and Clodsire. I'm not seeing any Mag Cargo spawns. And Slugma. I'm not going to use a team that uses Slugma. 
We can never have too many sires. Yeah, I mean, they, they're, they're different Pokedex entries, right? So that you can use two of them on a uh, competitive team. Because they're not forms. Actually, I don't even know. Can you use different forms in the same Pokemon? Like Alolan Sandslash and regular Sandslash. Does that count? But I also heard that at the moment, competitive is bugged anyway because you can use the legendaries in the DLC in the in competitive, which is broken. It's like they didn't update the ban list to include the new legendaries. Oh, I know. I know, sub. I wouldn't even need, like, four other Pokemon. I just need the two Sires. It doesn't look like we're going to get any Mag Cargo around here, so I might have to catch another Slugma to evolve it. Yeah. Encore! Let's check the map, because it might say... Oh wow, you can get Mimikyu up here? Okay. <gasps> Chimeco! I'm actually going to save here. Because I don't want to lose this Chimeco. It seemed like it's a quite a... A relatively rare spawn. Hey, nice. Shiny Ditto. Let's go. Now, did you... I, I'm curious. Did you Outbreak Hunt it? Because... They fixed a lot of the outbreaks in the in the update. I want I, I haven't seen any Ditto outbreaks to test it out yet, but I'm wondering if they fixed it. Ah, oh, Chimeco. Oh, that did nothing. Um I'm gonna try Fell Stinger. This could be a bad idea. Okay, that was good. I'm, I'm already- I've already got a nickname for this guy, chat. Don't worry. I know exactly what to call it. I kind of want to use it on my team, but I know it's trash. <laughs> I know it's terrible. But just out of curiosity, chat. What would you nickname a Chimeco? I'll see if any of them I like more than the one that I've got in my head. Covenant is so good in this game. I beat Shiny Sylveon, Shiny Hero Palafin in a streamer tournament. Very good. I'm, I'm so pleased for you. My Chimeco killed itself. I was not amused. Wait, it used Explosion? As did a shiny sea dot that exploded, but I turned around and found a shiny Vulpix, so I was happy again. Ribbon's cute. Chimeco nickname. Yep. Yes. Yes, that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to figure out a nickname for Chimeco. Banner. Banner? I hardly know her. Bing bong. <laughs> oh no! Don't make me cry, sub! <laughs> Name it Nickname. Back train, you genius. If only you weren't the first person to suggest that. You're hunting Cramorant? Let's go! What's it? Cormorant? Alright, all of your names were, were okay, but they didn't bring- they didn't beat the one that I had in my mind. It uses the suck on its head to hang from a tree or from eaves. It can produce seven different tones. I'm calling it Dingaling. What if you made it all the way to Honolulu with Chimeco? Think of the headlines. Nah. Alright, any other Pokemon around here? Or do I have to catch myself a Slugma to evolve it? There is a... an entrance gate over there for something. Hello? The 
crystal pool? Oh, I think I know. Oh. Okay, I think I know what we might find up there. Crystals. I mean, baby? Hey, Andre Dre, what is up? Has to be one of my favorite places in Kitakami. Dude, I would hate to climb this. This would be a nightmare. But my character makes it look so easy. Coughing! We've got coughing up. I wasn't expecting coughing, I'll be honest. Yo, what the hell? Look at this! That's like the crystals in, um... Area Zero. Long ago, the crystal pool was infused with crystalline material from an unknown source. Its water is a faint glow, but safe to drink and even serves the villagers' water source. Tales say that gazing upon the glowing water can allow you to meet those who have passed on. Oh, there's definitely something in that water then. Ha! Yay! It's underwater, Tudor. It's also like three FPS. I mean, the music's okay, it's just jingly and pretty. It's alright. Nothing crazy, though. <laughs> 